What is going on guys? Today we're back for another team of the season, a Liga Nos review, and it is going to be Pizzi, 93 rated right mid, um, the second highest in this team, bar from obviously Militao, um, who is not, actually no, is Militao a 92 in fact? Um, obviously you've got uh, Bruno Fernandes being the 94, yeah Militao is a 92 um, in this squad, so relatively Nice price, 82k for a 93 rated. I personally got him in my red picks this week as well, um, literally today. So, quite a nice card. I think 93 rated is really nice. 82k for him. You can't really complain at that, to be honest. Um, a lot of them obviously dropping in price. Um, potentially could go up out of packs, but probably not a hell of a lot. I don't think many, part from, bar from obviously Militao, potentially Bruno and Felix being super subs there um, are really going to be wanted in many people's teams. Of it as well, actually, Tellez as well. Just because I've got Tellez untradeable, I completely forget about him. But he, again, is another good one in case you are looking for someone. Um, but busy. So looking at his basics, it's five foot ten, four star weak foot, three star skill moves. Four star weak foot is lovely. Three star skill moves as a winger or at least a midfielder um, that's going to be crossing. I I really it's it's horrible because I really wish he had the four. I think this card would have leaps and bounds more to add to your team if he just had that one extra skill moves. Literally, that that is all that kind of puts this card back. Really, um, everything else to him is very very nice. He's got. Quite decent pace. Obviously, that can be fixed with a Hunter. He's got 89 shooting, which, again, gives you 98 positioning. You whack a Hunter on this card, it gives you 99, 94 finishing, and 96 shot power. That, for me, is perfect. Um, you got already got nice passing and dribbling with 94 and 93. Some really nice stats there. Um, stamina is 99, so up and down the pitch. Strength-wise isn't there at all 69 is his, is his actual stat for me that is just not good enough um pace wise if you're going to put a hunter on him you can kind of get away from that kind of overbar overbearing strength from say a left back right back but with the pace obviously there is times where he will the, the player will catch you and you need to make sure that you've either got strength or skill moves. And unfortunately, that is a bit of a lacking issue with Pizzi. So for me, he's more of a super sub. I think he, he makes a great super sub. You could even play him in ca a cam role, potentially more kind of a passing assisting cam rather than kind of your skillful dribbling around everyone, shaking off all the defenders. I personally would have him as a wonderful assister. He's got a great pass. He's got a nice dribble on him, but the skill moves does let that down. Um, and apart from that, I I think he is just a really cheap, affordable card. I think 93 rated for an 80 rate uh, for an 80k card is decent. It's it's decent enough. We're just about to get into some clips, and this is the issue with him. I've got four or five clips that that's the problem. I played eight or so games with him, and he just didn't really pop up much. And to be honest, some of the clips are very. They're grasping at straws, to be honest. He wasn't really in the game as much. Maybe because, yeah, he might be needed to come into maybe a right forward position or try him as a right uh, as a right cam. I personally tried him as a right wing to see what it'd be like and a right mid. But I never really thought about the right forward kind of zone just because I didn't have that on the team. Um, but you see that great playing. He's got a great pass on him, good dribble. Um, and then the problem is... He just, he, I don't know, he just can't finish. A great assist there for the striker. Um, lovely, lovely chip. And then this goal is the weirdest one. I had one of my friends playing with me, and I can't tell if the guy let them score or just really could not play. So, literally, literally just watch this for a second. How many keepy-ups can he do? He does drop the ball a couple of times, but I, I don't quite get what the defender's doing. And he, he carried on after this. Like It's not even if, like actually, after this happened, he left. He played for a good 20 minutes to get another goal and carried on and then quit. I don't quite get why that was, but great goal nonetheless. Like They'll be happy to see that one. Um, fantastic goal. Good volley on the end there. Um, so it does have the nice shooting and, and I, I can say why he has the skill moves there. <laughs> he has the keep you ups down. Let's say that. Um, 8.5 I'm giving him. 
I think, like I said, the main pros and cons to this card, dribbling, passing, and positioning is fantastic. Shooting is decent. I think with a Hunter, it's even better. Um, the major cons for this card is his strength and the three-star skill moves. I think they're literally the only two things that really step this card down and really hold this card back from being something really nice. A very nice link to Ronaldo, Eusebio, um, and also, obviously, the Bruno Fernandes. Good link there. Um, I think that is the major thing that this card's missing, and that is literally it. Value for coins is obviously 9 out of 10. I think 85k for a 93 rated team of the season is absolutely fantastic. And for foot champs, he's definitely a super sub. I don't see him starting in anyone's team unless they're a real fan of either Benfica or the Liga Nos. Um, apart from that, hopefully you did enjoy this video. Like I said, if you're new around here, a subscription, a subscribe is always fantastic. And if you want to whack that bell button on as well, that means a hell of a lot for me. Leave any comments down below if you want to see any more reviews of whoever. Um, and also, just let me know what you think about this one. If there's anything that you'd like to change, anything you'd like to add, that is always appreciated. I'm trying to strive to get better and we're absolutely smashing it. So if you did enjoy, like I said, make sure you give it a like and I'll see you all for the next one. Peace.